Today's mathematical exercise is crowd count. What I do, I will crowd, I will count StarCraft units and multiply by their numbers to find the sum of all units. It is a lot of counting and multiplying, so let's begin. First, I have the value of the SCV. The SCV is the worker of the Terrans. What I have to do is to find how many SCVs do I have on this picture. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I have 7 SCVs multiplied by 32 because the number is 32. That will equal 224. I will write these numbers on a paper and then I will sum all of the units. Okay, the next one is the Lurker. The Lurker is a very nasty unit of the Zerg. It burrows in the ground and shots from there with a lot of damage, where it damages everything on the line. I have one, two, three, four. Four workers multiplied by 17. That should equal 68. Uh, what's that? <laughs> Nonsense. Okay, the next unit that I have to count is the Dragoon. A very, very, very good unit of the Protoss that is not existing in the second version. It's replaced by those stalkers. Not that strong. Anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven dragoons. Seven dragoons multiplied by 25. That is 175. Now I have used the calculator earlier to find these numbers. So I will just pass through every one of them. Okay, the next unit is the tank, the siege tank. It is not in siege mode. Let's see, one, two. I have two tanks multiplied by nine, that is 18. And the last unit is the hydralist or hydralisk, simply called the hydras. They are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 1 hidden here, 7. 7 multiplied by 11 is easy, that is 77. Now what I have to do is to sum all of these numbers to receive a number of 5, 6, 2. Five hundred and sixty-two. Okay, the next picture I have first is the right. The right is a flying unit of the Terrans. <coughs> it uh, also has that clocking ability. How many rights do I have? One, two, three, four, five. Five, five rights multiplied by nineteen is equals ninety-five. Okay. The next unit is the Mutalist. The Mutalisk is this of the flying unit of the Zerg. One of the flying units. They are one, two, three, four, five. Five Mutalist. Mutalisks. Multiplied by 42. That equals 210. <laughs> okay. The next unit is the Scout. How many Scouts do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. There are 7 Scouts on the map. Multiplied by 8. 7 by 8 is 56, right? The next one is the Science Ship. Science Vessel. Now, it has that uh, awesome ability to make the defensive map defensive matrix. Now, in older days, 
I remember we used the defensive matrix on battleships. Now in tournaments of StarCraft uh, 1, I, I see that uh, players use defensive matrix on dropships and uh, dropping units in the enemy worker lines where the workers collect minerals. <laughs> Clever, actually. And <clears throat> there are three science ships multiplied by 27 that equals 81. Yep, 81. And the last unit that I have to count is the queen. The queens are special units of the Zerg that make nasty spells. One, two, three. There are three queens. Three queens multiplied by 32, that equals 99. <coughs> now, if I sum all of these numbers here, I am receiving a number of 541. That is 541. Yep. And the last count that I have to do is with the What's that? Ultralist. This is the Ultralist, the strongest unit of the Zerg. It's big and bites. It, I think it bites a lot of units at once, at least in the StarCraft 2. Okay, I can see one, two, three, one hidden here. Three Ultralists. Multiplied by 26, that equals 78. 78. Then I have to find the... What's that? Hey, I know this. The Goliaths. <laughs> Those are the Goliaths. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 Goliath. Goliaths. Mm, multiplied by 14. That equals 112. Okay. Then we have the Arkan. They are easily spotted. One, two, three, four, five, six Arkans. This is a very strong unit, Protoss unit. Well, strong is hard to say. They have a lot of shields. What is that? Six. Six multiplied by 38 is this big number, 228. Okay, then I have the drone. This is the worker of the Zergs. How many drones are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Huh, this is easy. 10 drones multiplied by 40 equals uh, by 4 equals 40. 40. And finally, the voucher. Now, in these days, in tournaments, I can see players use vouchers to place their mines and to harass. One, two, three, four, five, six, six vouchers multiplied by 21 equals 126. Now I have to sum all of this to receive a number of 584. Four. And that's correct. Now I have my new knowledge level. Uh, I will show here the calculations. There they are. They are clumsy, but they worked <laughs> apparently. And this will be about the math from next week the end of this month, month, I'm beginning more interesting uh, subjects like geography. So, I will play geography games and make geography exercises. If you're curious, well, until new meetings then.